think there's a God. And most people never take the next steps because the next steps are often the scariest. What if? What if there is no cosmic designer, father figure? What if everything is not part of a master plan? Mm -hmm. And I, I'm interested in you on that last couple of steps there. I mean, did you hang out there for a while? I did hang out there for a while. I realized that I no longer wanted to be associated with the Christianity of my youth. And so I started calling myself a follower of Christ. Um, and my my boyfriend at the time had described me as Christian and I corrected him and I said, you know, I'm, I actually don't like calling myself Christian anymore. Uh, I don't I don't like uh, what it means to me and the people that I see using it. I don't want to be associated with that. I told him I was like, I still believe in God, but, you know, just not that God. And he's like, well, why do you still believe in God like at all? And I just was blank. he started watching this documentary called Jesus Camp and uh, it shows a children's pastor teaching these kids how to essentially like pray in tongues. And I w could not handle watching even 10 minutes of this film. I started shaking and I was so.